I love this area of reactivate former customers. I had a client once who reckoned he could grow his business instantly by 40% in revenues simply by initiating this, which would have at least doubled his profits. But great opportunity here. Um, questions, why do customers normally stop doing business with you? How many customers on your list are inactive versus those that are active? Just gathering some information. Do you have an established policy or procedure or system for reactivating former customers? Okay, if they say no, which they probably will, then of the customers on your list, how many do you think could be persuaded to start buying from you again? And there's your area of impact right there. Now, if they do have an established policy or procedure, you come over here and what have you done in the past to reactivate them? You want to dig in here. If they haven't done much of the customers on your list that are inactive, how many of those could be persuaded to start buying from you again? What do you think would be an effective action that would bring some of your former customers back to you? So again, they might have the answers for you and um, do your hard work for you. Now, what have you done in the past to reactivate customers? Again, if they've got something, what were they? How effective were they? What percentage did you get to purchase from you again? Are you continuing in them? There's another big opportunity. If yes, have you worked on maximizing its effectiveness? If no, why not? Do you think it would help to return to those processes and get them formalized? and systemized okay so if yes well it will help you're gonna find your impact if no that's the end so are you continuing in them yeah have you worked on maximizing it no there's your impact if yeah well it's the result do you see room for improvement again you're gonna find an impact right there possibly if yes explain it put the impact uh, in that box at the bottom and we'll add 3% to be consistent.